The power of watercolor has been unleashed in Corel Painter 2022. You can now use dry media and other types of compatible brushes on a watercolor layer without needing to convert it to a default layer first. This unlocks a lot of new techniques that can be explored by mixing media together. Ever wanted to make chalk flow like a liquid? Now you can. To locate brushes that are compatible with watercolor layers, look for the compatibility icon in the brush selector or use the new filters feature to show only those brushes. As you can see, many categories of media can be mixed with watercolor layers. I'll create a new watercolor layer to paint on. Then I'll select the chalk brush in a medium blue color. If I try to draw on the canvas, I'll get a warning message that lets me know that this brush may look different on this type of layer because it's normally used on a default layer. I'll continue painting on this layer, and if I like, I can remember that preference in the future. With a larger brush, I'll paint some chalk onto this watercolor layer. Once I've done that, Painter considers this chalk to be a wet medium. If I select a watercolor brush like Watercolor Pigment Wetting Agent and select white for my color, I've essentially chosen pure water without any pigment in it. When I paint with water on the chalk, it diffuses as if I were painting on dried watercolor paint. I can also use real watercolor brushes like Dirty Water to erase from the chalk while eroding the pigment in a wet way. As you can see, this opens the doors to all sorts of mixed media effects. You can also transform a watercolor layer without converting it to a default layer. This means you can rearrange watercolor while preserving its wetness and editability.